In this video, we're going to take a minute to introduce the body of revolution component. And if you think about it, this is very similar to, say, a duct component. So there's duct, there's body of revolution. And both of these are effectively a wing that's been given a loop design policy so that it wraps around on itself and connects back at its own route. So if you think of it that way, rather than as, say, a custom fuselage or stacked where you're building from the front back to the end, a lot of the stuff that you use to make this is going to make sense. So let's take a look at some of the behaviors that we have. So general, we've got our tessellation settings here. That makes sense. Mass properties, etc., just like anything else. Under the design tab, we have access to a few different design modes, flow through, upper, and lower. Now, we'll get into a bit more detail of what those mean, but just know that that is where you can control them. You have access to your diameter, your angle. So negative is pushing things outward, positive is closing it in. So this is going to control your exit area. Note that it's computing your inlet and exit areas, your minimum areas, and you have access to leading edge and trailing edge clustering, just like with a wing. So if you move on to our cross section tab, Note here that we have access to all of the usual VSP cross sections, just like with any other customizable component, but we have one. So because this is an axisymmetric body, you define one cross section and the entire geometry is computed for you. Finally, we have access to the modified tab because once again, this is very similar to a wing component or a duct. So all of the controls that you have for the trailing edge, the leading edge, adjusting the closure or the trim, and adjusting your airfoil cross-section points is available for this component. So we're going to go into a bit more detail in some of these other tabs and look at some of the surface behavior on this component, but that was a bit of an introduction and it should get you started.